Okay, so now we have our faggoty pink texture uh, with a bit of a purple at the top. Uh, in the middle there's a little hint of an orange, an uh, orange, uh, yeah, yellowish hint. And at the bottom we've got a more uh, vibrant pink. Okay, so uh, let's see what this looks like in Iron View. Let's go save as. Uh, let's go to new folder just to uh, have a good starting location. Uh, we won't even bother naming the folder. Uh, pink. One. Okay, fuck it. And let's go and uh, save it as a JPEG as well. Okay, you can use JPEG or PNG. It's up to you. I've always preferred JPEG, so uh, make sure you set the quality to high maximum. Okay. So now let's go to IM View. And uh, let's change this one. Oh, this is a uh, Meshbow Cult Baby, so a uh, very good uh, developer. Let's uh, put this on here. So, as you can see, it looks pretty plain. It doesn't look that great. Um, we got a little bit of a hint of the uh, the more purplish color at the top. You can see a bit of a color of the uh, the orange coming through here. The red, not so much. It's a uh, yeah. So uh, let's go have a look and uh, see what we can do with the shine. You know, the red's pretty much cut off with this opacity map at the bottom here, as you can see. But uh, okay, let's go and um, switch back to Photoshop here. Okay, so we want to be able to reset the layer effects. So new layer, and let's select both of them and merge layers. And now we want to go back into the gradient effect. So we're going to start making the shine. Now you can do it this way. We can go overlay. And we can go in here. Now what we're going to do is we're going to make a custom gradient. So in here, let's move this aside. So we can see what we're doing a bit. Okay. We don't want to start with black, so we're going to change this color. And you do that by just clicking over there. Um, I'm going to do the same over here. So you can see it gets a bit darker. Okay. Now, I want to do some more in the middle here. And let's go, yeah, make that 50%, not 51. Uh, let's do the same over here, 75%. And we'll do the same here, 25%. Okay, now we'll go in here, we can click around about 12%, drag it over to 12%, and you go to choose the whitest color. As you can see, there's a bit of shine coming across. And we're going to repeat this process. We just click on it and over here, over here, over there. Okay. Hmm. Something doesn't go right here. Okay. So just uh, enable those 
Okay, so as you can see, we've got more shine in there, a bit of a highlights going through, very white. This is going to shine brightly. So let's okay that. Okay, let's save it again. And we'll have a look at it in Iron View. This time we'll call it 2. So you can see it looks a lot more shinier than the one before. Here's the one before. So now that's the before and after. You can see the comparison already. Um, we'll just go and as you can see you get much more body there coming through you get like the, the white uh, shine is much more pronounced so uh, yeah next up we're going to work on uh, colorizing this a bit more so for now that's it so uh, next video will be up next